what's up y'all so um these are the kind of like i know like y'all probably looking for like the fun stuff the crazy stuff the funky stuff the dances hey oh, hey but anyway that's like extra credit for me that's what i do for fun that's what i'm jumping for fun when i'm jumping to get a workout in i usually go for the whole thousand straight oh yeah by the way i'm burning that henry up because i know some of y'all gonna share this out some of y'all are gonna share this video out so you need to like it and you need to share it okay anyway i am burning that henry of make it fun nyc where i make jump rope and exercise as a whole more fun and exciting for anyone looking to live a healthy and active lifestyle yes if you need jump ropes ask me i got them if you need a 30-day workout guide ask me i got it if you need a tutorial on how to jump ask me i got it <laughs> so i got a lot of stuff so anyway i just did a video showing y'all the workout right i did a thousand jumps but some of y'all may be um beyond that and may want a little bit of extra credit so i'm gonna just show you a few things don't ask me to give y'all the whole full elaborate um tutorial because that's why i got tutorials online for and that's why i have in-person classes and that's why i train people individually on how to jump so this right here is the free stuff take advantage of it um but um yeah let me just show you a few things if you get bored with doing like the regular jump okay so you can mix it up and burn even more calories all right real quick because i gotta go to work So here is a lighter rope, and I got this from Jump Plus World, my friend Adrian Benghadi, world best jump roper. This is her jump rope. This is the rope that I use on like this ground right here. I have one of my favorite prize ropes that I use for my dance routines, but I would not dare use this on this ground or else I'll be buying a new rope tomorrow. So um, here are a few things that you can do to mix up your jump rope um, routine if you get bored. Like I said, if you want um, extensive tutorial, I do have some of my YouTube channel or I have in-person classes, or if I'm not in your state or city, just send me a request and I'll make arrangements to get to your city to do a workshop, okay? All right. So, we're gonna start off with the SJs. I'm not gonna show you the way that I really, really do them once I perfect them. Those are for my classes. But if you wanna mix up something, here you go. One, two, jump. One, two, jump. One, two, jump. Jump. That's stop. So, in order to do that skill, all you have to do is know how to do two side swings and jump. So, you swing, you swing, you open, and you jump. Okay? Aim for that two times. Now, next, it's a side swing combo. Okay? Here you go. Jump, swing, jump, swing, jump, swing, jump, swing, jump, swing, 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 swing. All right? So the skills that you need for this basically is to swing and to jump. What makes this different from the other one is that you're doing two swings and a jump. This one you're gonna swing, jump, swing, jump. So here's the difference between the two. The first one I showed you, swing, swing, jump, swing, swing, jump. The one I just showed you is jump, swing, jump, swing, jump, swing. All right, boom. Whew. So mad I don't have my water cup down here with y'all, but it would be. <laughs> Next, um, I'm gonna show y'all the crossover, right? And if you don't know how to use the, do the crossover, use my formula. My formula will get you doing crosses in no time, all right? So when you do the cross, you're gonna do the one, two, three method, right? Because a lot of people are scared. They they scared they're gonna hit themselves. Or they, uh, don't worry, y'all. I'm a professional. I still get hit, okay? I still hit myself, all right? So, you're going to use the one, two, three cross method, all right? So, when you're jumping, right, the goal is to get the rope under your feet, right? When you're crossing, the goal is to get the rope under your feet. So, here's a jump. Here's a cross. Oh, look at that, y'all. See, I told y'all I messed up. I'm not perfect, you know? There you go. So, the goal is to get the rope under your feet. So, what, what you're going to do with the cross, you're going to do one, two, three, cross. All right, I'm going to show you real quick. So I gotta go, y'all. Gotta go. <laughs> so, one, two, three, cross. One, two, three, cross. One, two, three, cross. One, two, three. All right, y'all. If y'all missed that, just rewind it a little bit. But basically, you want to use the one, two, or three cross method. When you cross, you want to make sure you fully extend. And the reason why I give you that number is so you won't be afraid. So it's like one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Now next, double under. Same thing. One, two, three, jump. One, two, three, jump. All right, y'all? Show y'all real quick. 
really watching the show because I got to go to work. <laughs> so, one, two, three, and up. One, two, three, and up. One, two, three, and up. All right? So, that's your one, two, three, and up. All right? So, let's combine one, two, three, cross, one, two, three, and up. So, that's your combination. By the time I come back here again, I better, I will, some of y'all better show it to me and hashtag make it fun and YC. All right? So, One, two, three, cross, one, two, three, and up. One, two, three, cross, one, two, three. All right, y'all, so that's it. That's all I got for y'all today. I hope y'all have a wonderful, phenomenal day. Be sure to share this out. Hope to see y'all in y'all city or town. Once again, I'm teaching in Philly this Saturday, September 1st, 2 o'clock and 3 o'clock. Be sure to register today. I'm teaching in New York City, Manhattan, um, September 15th. Make sure you register for those classes. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments. I'll talk to y'all soon. Have a phenomenal day. <laughs>